for our kids, if you ask, what do you like best about Free to Be Me is that it's fun. For us as parents, we look at it and we think it's just an absolute blessing because it really takes the dis out of my son's ability and it really just enheightens his ability. I opened the gate in June of 2005 and the idea was that we create a space that we would provide opportunity for children, youth and families to become physically active in a non-clinical environment. Our bodies are designed to be active, to keep moving. We create that opportunity for all kids um, of all kinds to participate in physical activity. To see the Free to Be Me become so successful for so many families, it's without words. At Free to Be Me, I feel empowered and enthusiastic to push myself and become stronger and healthier. That's the beauty of the Stedward Centre and Free to Be Me, is it's uh, giving the skill set to allow the playing field to be equal into adulthood, and there is nothing out there like this. Nothing. My name is Joanne Picard, or you can also call me kind of a big deal. I want to feel comfortable to be myself and enjoy my workout. I can do that at free to be me. It feels like a safe, judgment-free zone. Often we as parents, we get wrapped up in doing all the right therapies and we often forget that they're children and that the best way for any child to learn is through play. And that's why the kids love it and then the parents love it. So I have a daughter, Laura, and she started with Free To Be Me when she was a little girl, around seven or eight. She wasn't successful in her community activities and she wanted to be physically active. The coaches and support people at uh, the Free To Be Me Centre knew how to accept her for what she was, like if she was going to be loud that day, oh well, she's going to be loud that day. And that takes a lot of stress off a parent's shoulder when you know your child's not having a good day, is it going to be okay? Are they going to be able to go to this session, participate in this session? Yep, they were. She, she always participated regardless of how she showed up and it always ended up something positive. When my son first came here, he could barely sit and hold his body. We had no possibilities. It was 100% focused on how the world was closing in on us. Now we're looking at getting him ready for football. Uh, if you had told me that 10 years ago, I would have said never. We're giving the opportunity to learn at their pace so they can participate in physical activity anywhere. Now that I'm older, my workout routine is similar to my friends, but I use a lot of modified equipment. Give them confidence and self-esteem and skill set and friends and positive energy and he gets that from here. And as Canadians and as people that work in the centre, I know they don't like to boast about who they are, what they are and what they've accomplished, but someone has to do it for them because we really do need to let the world know the great contribution that we are making to the lives of people with disability.